Hey there guys, Headphones Neil here, back with my review for Star Wars, or my next review for Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. So for this particular review, it's going to be um, searching the underground base and locating the star map on Manan. So um, I've gotten, as far as I can tell, the access that I need, so um, we can now go under to the underwater base, find out what's going on, and... Um, see if we can locate the star map. Having played it before, we know that is there. Um, I'm actually kind of looking forward to this particular part because I want to see how the game looks um, as far as underwater goes um, and the graphics that they had at the time. Um, I think about all I was able to do at, when I first was playing it initially was that it was maybe medium graphics at best, in general low graphics to um, for sure, so that I could play the game without skipping and um, hiccups and things like that. So um, we'll see how it goes this time around. So we get our usual cutscene of the sh um, submer submarine going to the underwater base. Um, that's about all I can really say. I remember that there's a base and there's a star map and there's a really, really big fish that we have to either kill or move around in order to... Um, get to the star map so um, basically I'm just gonna do the usual walkthrough and um, see if we can find the map or get to the map after that um, when we get to the shore I believe um, the Selkath ban us from staying in the um, or as a dark side user I think um, the Selkath will ban us from remaining um, it, uh, remaining in the on the planet as a Jedi, um, I believe that I think it's the same thing, or they don't. I forget what the how severe the punishment is, but um, my main memory is that they do ban you from the planet. Um, so you another cutscene for a character that's down here. Um, so I guess something went wrong. Um, because all the droids are activated, a lot of people were killed down in the base. Um, so that's a little bit more information for the base and what's going on there. Um, let's see, there's no way to stop what happened. It uh, looks like the major problem on leak. There's sharks out in the ocean. So... Um, uh, once we get rid of this guy, we'll see what the journal entry is, find out what's going on. So mission for the Republic. So all the Selkath and defense stations in the station have gone crazy. Uh, it's called a Hracker Rift. Um, so there's a uh, mad crazy Selkath and a malfunctioning machinery. So um, I guess that's going to be the thing to uh, work around and get through to um, get around all the cell cath and machinery and um see what we can do from here so um i guess this is going to be a lot of saving as we go so uh it looks like dark jedi have been killed as well so oh, switch to get so we'll, uh, get as much um equipment as we can we do get so we do have the uh, sharks going around. So that's a nice bit of graphic that I don't remember. Um, so I guess they're. So I guess it's one of those things. It's probably graphics that. Um, or there's lots of there's going to be a lot of graphics and things like that that we do have to get around. So um, I guess we can't. I don't want to talk to him right now, so let's see what's in the foot locker. Maybe we'll need to get someone's uh, pass card or something to unlock the door. So, um, so don't know what happened to drain life uh, force lightning force push
So that's actually kind of weird. I'm not sure why I don't have force um, drain life anymore, but I'm going to take a quick look. Maybe it's um, related to my armor. So, um, all right, so once my lightsabers go down, then I'll have to take a look at that. So, Dark Jedi Master Robes, switch to Dark Jedi Knight Robe, and um, in the next battle, I'll, I'll take a look, see if, uh, oh, there it is. So, I guess um, my armor was blocking um, my whatever force ability for that is that's related to um, draining life. So I think at some point I'm hoping that I can eventually um, get uh, get that upgraded to I think it's called Death Field when you um, have the ability to either do a more um, intense drain life or essentially kill someone who's um, not able to resist enough of um, your force power, so, so more Jedi Master Rogue, so let's see about, so, so this is one of those times when having a droid would be, um, useful, or having a good repair ability would be useful, so, unfortunately I don't have that, so, that's quite alright, but, for the sake of, um, kicks, let's see if we can, so maximum firepower, let's see if we can, oh, I don't have enough pair parts. So, okay, well, well for that. So let's switch to Bastella level, or get some health back. So we're good there. So can't use that door. So essentially these for the, until we can go, I or explore the base, I believe it's going to be one of those things where we're going to have to go around the base so we can eventually find the um, suits to navigate um, out into the ocean in order to um, get to the star map. So we'll have to wait till Basila is saved. So, yeah. so it's one of those things that I do remember having to navigate around the base quite a bit, but um, at some point there's going to be um, a corridor that we can't go down, so when that happens we'll, um, I just remember, so the, or now I'm starting to remember the, um, the suits being um something that can be picked up. Now, I don't remember if it's um, just one set of suits or um, a, 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 a full set of suits, but um, whatever the case, um, we'll see, from there we'll have to see about um, what we can do from there as far as whether something that has to be done on your own and the rest of the... Um, group has to stay behind or if it's like one set of um, s um, swimsuits per the, for the whole group I guess um, so it looks like we're approaching um, some sort of doors because of those leaks that are happening now I'm not sure if that's the whole um, Um, base or just this particular area because we're getting closer to the um, walkway in order to get outside and into the um, waterway. Now the one thing I do remember that was kind of funny when I did play the game before was if you use force run while in the suit it does the animation looks funny because you're running really fast but um, that's neither here nor there in the game itself. So 
I'm not sure why this droid is a little bit, oh, it's a heavy sentry droid. So taking out a heavy droid, I guess, is a little bit more difficult. So they did take a little bit extra um, life out of me and Bastella. So we'll heal everybody up and do a quick save. Um, see what's in the footlocker. Some more grenades. So let's see what the... The dead soldier has anything of value. Uh, emergency cell. So uh, nothing interesting in there. I think one of these has a, a guy. So there is a guy hiding in the cabinet because he's scared. Um, so we want to lure him out. So. on dark side energy points for um, having worn him so I just got a new so let's see if I can we got a poison blade let, so I'm gonna quickly go through some of um, okay so one of the things I picked up it looks like it's a data pad um, looks like he created something in the one of the rooms as a sonic emitter, which scares him off. The sound works underwater, so um, I'm gonna have to pick that up. So these lockers look like they just have parts and stuff. Um, so oh, one more locker, I guess. Almost missed one. So. Uh, now that I have all that, um, so we'll see why this guy is fighting some sort of cell cath. Looks like they're all crazed. Uh, and force push is a nice little animation there. So. Vassal and Candorus are getting pretty effective on that side, and I got myself the Sonic Emitter. So, I'm gonna pick up Remain, see what's uh, if there's anything good. So, I guess I can't go through that door. So, um, and as I keep going, getting through in um, my reviews, is that Force Run is slowly becoming um, a better and better um, tool to use. So, if you can, if you do get um, Force Run, make sure you do use it as uh, when you can. So this shield is in my way. Don't know why where Bastella and Candrith one. I guess they're while fighting someone else, so... so this next guy, because I guess I got some poison, so I'm gonna have to, I'll try and drain life, see if that helps me out a little bit. Oh, and I do get to level up, so hopefully I can improve my death field and use the Sith Master robes instead. And look, oh, there's Candor and Bast Candorus and Bastila, so I guess they were just behind a little bit. So I'm going to do my level up. Um, I guess I can't reduce my attributes, so um, I guess I'll do strength. It was fine. Skills. Yeah, I can't reduce those either. Um, so I'm going to increase my persuade ability. And then powers. So, um, since I already have Force Lightning or Storm, I'm not quite there yet. Uh, force Whirlwind, Drain Life, so Death Field. Can't get that quite yet, so let's see if I can. Um, so, I guess I'll upgrade my Force Whirlwind. 
uh, so small mailstorm except so uh, looks like Bastel has almost lost her life so let's heal everybody up really quick uh, looks like we're about to the point of the um, so let's pick everyone up don't want to talk to him so let's check out the remains. So okay, activating airlock control. Success. Okay, so I only have one environmental suit. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to run around a little bit. I'm going to see if I can find some more suits. Um, because I didn't go through um, all the corridors, I'm going to do a quick search through the rest of them and see if I can't find a few more. Um, basically fin finish the exploration and make sure that there's nothing that I missed that um, I could use to um, bring the party members with me because it's one of those things where it's always useful to have your party members. Um, let's make sure this wasn't the hallway that I came down. So. So I'm going to switch to Candorous really quick, see if I can get him to... Okay, so I don't have enough repair parts. So let's get some... Check out this footwalker plasma grain, so nothing I can do there. So... Uh, can go through that door. Okay, so the airlock is sealed from the other side. So I guess it's one of those things where I only have, where I'm only going to have one suit. Oh, so there's a door that I can fight through. So, um, yep, just one of those things. Fight, get through doors and see if fight, we can find more suits to wear as we go along. So, I guess you can't have your entire party. So what I'm trying to do as I bake through this door is that it's, um, instead of just having my main character only work through the door, I figured I'd have, try and have all of them work through the door to break it down. It's going a little bit faster. So um, I guess I have to keep my, once I have them helping me out, it should go a little bit faster. Um, it's still slow, but... You know, twice as fast is better than normal speed, I guess. So um, hopefully whatever's behind this door is worth it or it's not something that's a big surprise. And I don't know why Bastel has stopped attacking the door, but um, I want everybody to keep at it, so... Yeah, so this is going to probably take a while, so um, 
I think I'm going, so I don't have, let's see if I can switch to one of the other, um, so switching to other blasters and stuff to see if I can, um, I guess use the blaster instead as well, so. I guess I'll use an Ion Blaster and a Mandalorian Pistol, see if... So, maybe from a distance is a little bit better. before because I don't know that I had my either not something I never paid attention to or I had because I had the settings on low is the black detail attention to detail on the blasters is um, that a little bit more than I remembered so um, that's pretty good to know so I'm gonna re equip my sabers and I guess all of a sudden work that much better that time around but um, that was kind of weird that it um, worked once as a major thing so let's try dis disengaging and then going back to do it so That is kind of weird. So either they don't, they really don't want you to go through the door, or it's something that's that important. But I guess it's good to have your team members helping out, even though Pastela is not doing a whole lot. Although this is one of those times when I kind of wish that um, you could use a grenade or something at the, to throw at the door, just to have it explode that much uh, more quickly. the story is why it was um, all of a sudden one of those things that lets you that why it reduced the door that much more better I guess so um, That is actually kind of weird that the door went, was destroyed quickly in one instance but not um, as quick in another so um, yeah I know this is going to be kind of boring for the for everybody but now at this point it's almost the door is almost destroyed so I'm kind of curious as to what why it's not being destroyed so I figure maybe go down cancel and then go back and So yeah, this is kind of still kind of weird. So um, with Bastel, I guess we'll see if she can. So 
still really, really weird that it's taking this much um, effort to destroy a door, so, especially when the rest of the doors are um, not as hard to um, destroy. So, kind of weird, but see if I'm giving everybody some force valor and force points um, might be able to help everyone out. destroy the door while me and um, Bastila try to use our lightsabers to destroy the doors but it doesn't look like it's something that's gonna work as well in any case so I guess I'm gonna so I'm, I guess at this point I'm gonna just destroy the door or cancel that let's take a map uh, looks like from where I'm at, uh, it's probably because it's an airlock and it doesn't want you to go there. So I guess having that unlocked is a good thing. So from here, well, we'll go back to the other airlock. Not there. here just so that if anything goes wrong so I guess I have to go out in the airlock by myself but if I do get um, if I do manage to find more suits then um, I will take it from there it looks like um, no force power so um, I'm gonna have to I'll talk to this survivor, so once I get out in the ocean, or if I can get his suit out and bring everyone with me. So it looks like this guy thinks um, Republic crew, so we'll see what we can find here. So this guy's stuck here, there's a lot of... Uh, this guy found the, the crazy people but wasn't infected. So he found a way to seal off the base. Um, so there's an emergency override. So he, um, so he's gonna go out to the ocean floor. He doesn't want to spend any more time um, in this underwater base. So. Um, let's see what he happen what happens with him, but I guess I'll follow him for a little bit. Um, this part is gonna probably be a little bit tough just because it's so dark. So he's going out by himself. I think he's gonna get eaten by a fish. So we don't want to follow him, so I'm going to go back, explore the rest of this um, the, this part of the facility, but I guess the only way to get to the star map or avoid the sharks is to use the sonic emitter. I don't remember how long that actually lasts, so um, one of the things I'm going to, that I know I'll have to do is use the... Um, Sonic emitter and hopefully find uh, additional uh, suits to bring my companions with me. So 
but of course, yeah, first things first is to explore this area and see what else is down here just to see if there's anything else that can help. So this might be the welded door, it has been welded shut. I don't know that it's the one that we were just in or at trying to break down. So. So nothing there. So it looks like we have a foot locker as well. So let's see what is in this foot locker and um, hopefully something good and useful rather than just more med packs and stim packs. Oh, and of, of course it's just a frag mine so nothing useful there. So I guess one of the things to notice or for me to notice is that the quality of the bubbles is pretty good. Um, I kind of like attention to detail there. Um, for 2003 graphics it's not that bad but of course it's one of the things that could have been made better. Um, so of course this is still super boring and dull so um, hoping that if there's nothing else at the other end of this hallway or there's nothing else to explore I'm gonna um, have to find my way into the rest of the base and Hopefully that's enough to lead me to the um, star map. So that's the pressure door I think that I was just at. Okay, so nothing much there. So um, I'm going to head out to the um sea floor hopefully i can time the sonic emitters right so that the sharks ignore me so i'll do a quick save here so that if i have to do this all over again or um, resume then it's easy to resume from there so I'm hoping because I don't have any map or anything to go by that I'm going in the right direction um, part of me thinks that this is gonna be so yeah it looks like there's nothing else there to the left or sorry to the right of the door so I'm gonna have to go to the left and I'm hoping that it's enough uh, st um, or that the sonic emitter is enough to keep me going till I get to the other part of the base and hopefully that's enough to So Freya, I'm not sure what that is. Oh, looks like a shark. Okay, so I guess the sonic emitter didn't really work, so I have to figure out or make be more Or I guess maybe my sonic emitter ran out by then, so we'll give it another shot. If that still doesn't work, then I'll have to reread the journal and probably try and figure out a way to go around a little bit more. Oh, that's all I needed to do was use the sonic emitter, so. So I'm going to keep going as fast as the suit will let me, which so I guess every shark I see I'm going to have to make sure that uh, I use a sonic emitter I guess.
so I guess that's gonna be in. So I guess the idea here is to get to the doorway as fast as possible so I can get out of the water and do a little bit more exploring and make sure that I keep using the emitters as much as possible. So few on that part. Man, and I guess I so I found some more cell calf by going into this doorway. So um, I guess until I I'm no longer or until I get some force power back, I'm not going to be able to. So this is one of those cases where making sure you continue to have uh, med packs is a good idea, even though you have force users will on your side. So um, because it looks like it's, I'm going to be all on my own in this case sure what that was all about so sure why the game is suddenly stuck okay so sorry about that not sure why the game had a slight hiccup in the controls and navigation so um We'll see what's going on here. I, there's a guy to um, get out of that force field or convince him to open. So um, once we can take care of all these other distractions, we'll um, take care or we'll deal with him. Not sure. Or this is one of those things where. Um, from here, I don't remember too much else as far as this section of it goes, so uh, we'll see what's go what all this section is all about. So, breath mask. So, let's see. So I think I want to say that that reminds me a lot of. So there are suits lying around, but um, I don't know why they're there. So I'm going to take one more look at what the breath mask is all about. So, oh, good for a gas based attack. So, um, I guess if you're going to run into a lot of um, gas mines, I guess it should help out a little bit. So, I'll do some more grenades and a med pack. So, I guess good news there. So, force field. I guess I have to take um, so I want to destroy the force field to see what these guys are talking about so I guess these guys locked themselves in because they were afraid about someone coming in to um, we call the cell cat and the sharks might get in to kill them, so they don't know what happened. Something drove them mad. Um, so something in the research facility really went wrong, so they don't know what to say. So now they're introducing themselves. 
So they're sorry they tried to kill my character. Um, so now they're all trying to calm down because he got. I was able to get in and save them. Um, they don't know about a star map. No one seems to know anything. So there's excavations that might be able to help them. So a monster rose up in the rift. I think that's that big fish that I was telling about when I started the review. So um, we know that it's now protecting someone. So um, so something's driving and saying something's going wrong. So I guess they're all the star map is a lot away on the dark side of the force. So. Um, they're mining everything in that area. So what can we do about it? So the sharks are a serious problem. Um, blasters and projectile weapons sometimes work, but they're not really perfect. They have a compound that drives away something smelled or... So it looks like the um, top compound that they developed um, kills the sharks and might affect the colto as well. So let's see, how would I poison the shark? I could take the canister of toxin and take it before the shark, insert it into the main colto harvester, vent it, get away as soon as I... So I think that's the part that the cell cath really don't like, where they'll immediately drive you away, drive you off the planet. So or you could re um, repurpose the canisters to explode. I guess either way, the cell cath are gonna drive you off the planet. So they'll lose years of research. Um. So I'm gonna still put high poison the shark. I guess I don't know if it's better or worse. So now it's a matter of finding that that machine and doing that uh, one thing. I guess so. Uh, Peter's Pike. So let's see what the. Update is mission. So I guess I have to go into the. So before I do, I'm gonna check out the map really quick. So uh, to see floor. So um, I guess I have the one th the thing to do from here is to find that machine. this pressure door see if that's the one I left from or if it's a different one oh that's the one I left from so uh, so I guess your team member show up wherever you um, show up so I guess that's a good thing since I just came from um, that one door right there um, I guess I'm gonna have to find I guess uh, there's the star map, so that's I guess I just had to come and go out of sight of the um, correct doorway. So since I have the gas canister already, um, I guess it's a, a matter of programming it into the ruins, if I remember right. I'm hoping I'm right at this point. So I guess the running around was worth it. So. Uh, fuel tag and pressure control. So three continue pot of so fill injector pod.
So now it's a matter of um, so feed toxin to the vent. So let's see if that solves the problem. So that's the super big fish that I remember. Um, I guess the low graphics setting made it look a little bit more ridiculous. Maybe it probably, if I remember, I probably took the shininess and textures out of it a little bit so it make it look a little bit more silly for some reason i had the memory of it looking like the super mario brothers fish um so that looked a little bit more silly i guess but in this case it doesn't look as bad as i remember it so um um there's that so because the fish is um now destroyed i'm hoping that's all i needed to do so i'm gonna go and get to the star map um hopefully that's all there is as far as sharks go but i guess because i have the sonic emitter still that's a good thing so for some reason i still i could swear it up and down that i remember being able to use a force run in this case um, unless at the time there were cheat codes or something where you could upgrade the, um, where you could unlock all force powers or all force powers all at the same time. I just really, really don't remember this part taking this much time. So the fish was, um, saving the star map or protecting it and everyone went mad because of it. So, um, we've got this part done. So now we can um go back to so quest for the star map so we got another one as before but it's still incomplete so um now we can go back and um get off this get off this uh planet i don't know that they're gonna let us come back if we try to finish um the um mission for the Geno, Har Geno Harden. Um, so I think there's, if I remember right from the, what he said, that there's one person to kill on Tatooine, one on Dantooine, and one on Kashyyyk. So once I get the star map, the next plan is to at least try and take care of those. Um, the idea is that because you have, we have force run um, and we have a general idea of where everyone's at, that we can force run through that part get the um finish those missions and then um accomplish it but my memory of it as well is that um the the uh, rodian that hired us was basically trying to take out the competitors and take over or either he was lying or he was trying to take over the organization on his own and he was using our character to um, kill off his competitors because he wasn't strong enough to um, just kill them off himself so the idea from now is So I think this does look like the door that was um, welded shut from the other side. So because um, it's not important and we don't need to do anything from there. So we have a breath mask, uh, motion detection goggles, and detect almost any movement, advanced oral amplifier, neural band saves. So um, let's do a quick save and then force run. So we want to get back to our ship. So uh, straight into the left. So simple enough. This is probably the one of the easier levels to get through, or parts of the levels to get through. Oh, so Darth Bandon for some reason decided to show up now. So this is something I don't remember as far as um, I don't know how he found us down here or why it would show up here, but um, I guess it's fine that he's he found us here, so time to deal with him. So,
guess it was a good thing that I, I, I think I saved, so I'm hoping that it's a good thing that I saved. Um, uh, before we met him, so that's a good thing. Uh, and it's good that I have a Bastila to save my health, but this is going to be annoying with everyone causing fear, so... So, oh, actually, I'm not down. I guess I still have. Oh, man, down. darn, I shouldn't have used that grenade. So, um, I guess we'll use Bastila's Force Valor Speed or Force Shield, I guess. go into battle just so that or actually I should see if I still I do have um Chani and dueling swords and I'll switch to the energy shields. So just because we know we're going into this um situation we wanna So we we can reduce the number of um well oh, and I guess killing Bandin wasn't as hard as I thought, so that's fine with me. Or so So um he has forced lightning as well, so uh or sorry, four storm as well, so So I guess that's gonna be kind of annoying is to have to slowly lose my life to band in, in this way with uh Candorous. So I'm gonna have to probably find another way to defeat Band and either kill him first and then So, um, before I open the doors, I guess I'm going to have to think of another way to, or I guess focus on Bandon first. Um, I guess this is one of those situations where having three Jedi might be a little bit better, but um, Jolie Bindo isn't really, doesn't really have much um, training powers, I guess, or force health, so it's kind of annoying as far as that goes. So, let's... Upgrade the shields. Uh, Sith shield. Um, and I guess with her, let's do force shield, forced valor. And I think the next idea is to focus on uh, Bandon first, get rid of him, or maybe push him, see. Um, so, Bandon, uh, Force Whirlwind. So, This is going to be annoying because if he's going to show up every time I save the game, then um, it's going to take forever to beat him. So it depends on how long this whole, the whole um, So um, I'm going to have to come up with another idea. Um, I can't transit back to avoid him, so and I can't change my party members. So... Hmm. So this 
is going to be have to this is definitely going to be an interesting way to have to defeat these guys so uh, thing to do is um, actually I don't know what the other option is going to be as far as defeating Bandin goes uh, so let's see if I can push actually let's try throw lightsaber see if that okay so So, drain life, maybe. So I guess I'll keep doing that until... he has um, force or drain life probably or death field maybe so he's um, able to do that much more so um, I guess the trick here is going to have to be take out the two Sith acolytes and then deal with Bandin that seems to have progressed me a little bit further um, probably save my um, death or my drain life to until he um, save the drain life so that I can use it on Bandon I guess I'm not sure how I'm gonna resist him so maybe I'll try the breath mask again um, and then I'm gonna put on I'm gonna change up my fresh X armband so um, Let's shield everybody up. Lightsaber. So now we can deal with uh, Bandit, it looks like. Let's see if we can get him in a Force Whirlwind. Or I guess he'll get me in a Whirlwind first. I guess this is one of those times as being a Jedi you can um, bring everybody or give people help and bring your teammates back to life I guess so having Bastila out um, of commission right off the bat uh, is annoying so so I guess the current plan isn't really working well so 
So I want to make sure that I survive the battle long enough to... Um, so that's not going to work, so... Um, something else is going to have to be done with Pandan, so... Um, but the bulk of the Manon stuff is done, so... I'm uh, not quite sure what I'm, how I'm going to deal with getting around um, Bandon, I guess. So let me see if maybe I can um, plant some frag mines and then back everybody up, I guess. Maybe I can um, dis destroy... Um, didn't want to do that so I'm gonna um, deal so so I guess um, that semi worked. So I'm gonna take out, see if I can, um, so I guess I'm gonna have to deal with him just on lightsaber blows. Uh, um, and Bastille is down, so. Um, that's, that kind of sucks, and having Choke, I guess, and, um, not sure if he, it looks like he's using the Death Field on me, so, that's kind of annoying, so, uh, so it looks like we might, ah, perfect, so, So, I guess this last guy is going to be simple enough. And because I have Kalo Nord, it works itself out. So, um, let's see what we have with Bandit. So, he's a double blade lightsaber, Darth Bandit's fiber armor. So, let's see. So, uh, I'm still in combat, which. So before I move on, I guess, I'm going to um, use Basil to heal up since I don't know where the other guy went. So I'm going to check out um, Darth Bandon's. Um, looks like he has a good, a good amount of damage resistance. So I'm going to see if I can... Um, use his armor with um, my drain life. I'm hoping I can and at the next um, upgrade I'm hoping that I can adjust some of my or increase some of my stats so that I can um, uh, use the death feel instead of just drain life but I am getting to the point where I can um, or I do have force lightning but um, um, hoping I can get to the point where I can use the Force Storm, so um, not quite the same dramatic effect of um, Emperor Palpatine in Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker, or Episode 9 The Rise of Skywalker, but I'm um, also kind of hoping, but it's basically impressive enough where you can use it on multiple people, so that's why I, I don't remember how well I remember, or I don't remember how it looked, so I, that's why Darth Bandon's um, um, feet was, I don't know if it was Light the Force Storm or um, de Death Field to Steal Energy, so um, let's see, so we're talking to the um, main guy from the Republic Embassy, so he's asking why they went insane, so they killed almost everything in the station, so I guess we have to tell the guy that something woke up down there. Um, So I guess that will tell them about contaminated Colto. So from here, we don't want to tell anyone anything um, and that the damage goes away. But because um, of the gases, I don't think we can um, 
get away with it. So journal entry added, got some credits and dark side points. So let's see if the journal, so missions there are finished. So um, I guess I can't use Darth Bandit's armor. I can't use force speed. So can I use, so I guess I can use it with a dark Jedi master robe. So, um, Here is where I think we're gonna have to deal with the cell calf and their and dealing with what damage was caused. So I guess we have to deal with another trial before we can move on. So, so they're upset that we're, we went down there and that uh, we violated their treaty. So, and because they saw that the um, Republic has violated their treaty, um, so we'll tell them that the Sith were trying to, or lie to them to let them know that the Sith were down at the rift. So it's impossible, so we're going to have to try and see if we can convince them that the Sith had a base down there and not the Republic. So. Okay, so that didn't work. So, um, so we're just gonna. So there's the whole banning from the. Um, so I guess the selection I picked didn't work. Um, I'm not sure if that's something that would eventually figure it out. There's only so many lies you can tell before people figure it out, move on. So um, that brings us to the end of the Manon storyline. I'm going to um, see if I can get off the ship and still try and get rid of these Gizka. Um, I'll, I guess I'll bring Jolie and um, uh, Bastilla with me. I don't know if I picked her or if I went too fast. So let's see if I can get into the hallway even. So I can't get into the hallway and it looks like I will would be unable to complete the Geno, Har Geno Harden storyline. So um, any, in any case, if I can get back to um, the Geno Harden, then that would be great. But if not, then oh well. So uh, lights, so I'm just going to do a quick lightsaber check, um, so double bladed lightsaber, so I'm going to upgrade, Joel, or his is already upgraded, so, um, so I'm going to see if I can, um, upgrade Bandon's armor and still use force run with it. Um, that sign seems kind of annoying, but maybe because it's an, um, because it's a intermediate power, I guess it doesn't quite work as well. So, um, that's all there is for that. So, um, for now, I think I'm gonna, or I might try to do the, uh, or it depends on where it takes us, because I know that, um, Saul's, um, former Admiral guy's mission is coming up. Um, so I'll probably try and go to Dantooine and finish one of the Geno Harden missions and then go to Saul Karras ship if it causes me to um, get on board Saul K the Admiral ship then I will now make that the review and finish other missions later but it all depends on the order of things. 
So that's all there is for this particular review. I know it's a little bit longer than usual, um, but thanks for tuning in, and until next time. And of course, the website is pateln01.com, and Twitter is at pateln01 if you want to subscribe to the podcast, check out past episodes, and of course, find me online and get in touch with me on Twitter. But thanks for tuning in, and until next time.